degrees last night so I'm out here in the building where I put this stove in we're getting a fire started in it we'll check everything out I did a smoke test just to make sure it would draw fine and it did before I hooked the stove up completely so now we're just uh, putting this thing in here and getting the fire started and we're going to check out everything and see how it, uh, see how it does and I'll show you what we did on the outside I've had some questions about uh, the outside because I had the camera about uh, 40 feet away from when we were actually doing the actual uh, final install out there but I'll show you what we did and explain it a little bit more in detail well as you can see got smoke coming out up top with the fire inside it's uh, drawing real, real well so I'll show you what I did out here in closer detail um, This thing is nice and cool. It's triple wall. You can't feel any heat on this. Now, what we did, or what I did, was uh, there's this section right here. This is a nine inch um, sleeve that comes for the T. It comes with the stove. I mean, I'm sorry, with the uh, stove pipe. So what I did when I put the nine inch in originally, it was too close. And I said, well, I gotta come out a little bit. So what I did, I ordered a 12 inch uh, sleeve or stove pipe that I put to the nine inch. So that pushed it out far enough that I put these posts in the ground in order to put my uh, clamps uh, put the uh, straps on with the support piece underneath the stove pipe so this fits right up under the stove pipe it's at a little angle here on the bottom that's because when I put the strap on at the top it pushed that pipe back just a little bit more than I wanted it back I wanted it real close to the uh, E that's the reason for these posts as it goes up I'm able to get around that eave with straight pipe instead of, instead of having to buy a 15 degree angle pipe. Uh, that pipe would have cost me another uh, three, a little over $300 for that. So that's why I put these posts in in order to support the piece that the stove pipe sits on on the outside. So by doing that, it Everything is tied together. It's nice and firm. I can't even move this. And everything is supported well all the way to the top as you see the smoke rolling out of the top. So it's working great. Uh, like I say, the nine inch piece came with the Duravent uh, Galvalume uh, triple wall pipe. So by getting the 12 inch, the 12 inch runs from right at this seam right here to the inside of the thimble and the thimble is enclosed around that pipe so basically you got a four walls around that stove pipe going through the wall by doing that that takes away your uh, heat from the wall itself and everything is going up through the uh, stove pipe but you cannot feel any heat on that pipe at all with that stove with that stove uh, having a fire in it right now so but uh, by putting these like I say that going back to these posts putting them in I had to put some uh, spacers in in order for this because my posts uh, lean back just a little bit too much in order to try to keep everything level this will slide out and then that is your cleaning vent underneath the pipe it's in there with just a little screw right now to hold it in. Might be able to, if I take that out. Yeah, I'm not able, yeah, there it goes.
take that out and you can that's right up through the stove pipe so anyway I'll put that back on there leave that on there like that put my that's where you run your uh, brush up through the uh, pipe each season to clean it but um, anyway we've got a nice fire in there it seems to be uh, warming nicely inside got a nice draw on it and it uh, works out well so that's the update on it and hope you enjoyed it if you put one of these in it's it's not hard to do at all it's just uh, it does take a couple people to do it because you need an extra set of hands in order to uh, put that uh, when you're putting that stove pipe up and running that uh, pipe through the wall through the thimble in order to get it uh, set up on your uh, support piece that holds your chimney so anyway y'all have a good day get out and do something